Hi everybody, my name is Henry Tenby and welcome to this edition of Model Moment. As you can see, I'm hiding behind one of my favorite aircraft types, the Vickers Viscount. So what have we got here? This is a beautiful model. It's 170 second scale. It's a Vickers Viscount 800 British Air Ferries in the, uh, I think it's about a late, mid to late 1980s livery for the company. And this model is a one-piece resin model. Very accurate. Just giving you a bit of a visual tour of the model. It's got registration OBAF. Mounted on its original stand. Viscount Stephen Piercy is the name of the actual aircraft. Those of you that are Profliner fans, you'll remember the name Stephen Piercy. Stephen Piercy was the very flamboyant founder of Profliner magazine. He's no longer with us, but he was a fabulous, iconic enthusiast who documented Propliners back in the 1970s and 1980s. And uh, he, he, his memory lives on in many ways, and he inspired many of us in our hobby pursuits. So this model, as you can see, 172nd scale, it was made by, I'll show you the executive display models. That's Brian, that is Brian Austria Tompkins who ran executive display models from the Sheraton Skyline Hotel, Bath Road, Heathrow Airport uh, during the 1970s and 80s and into the 90s as well. Some of you might have visited his store. It was a absolute Aladdin cave a lot of models that he produced. He, he had a, a network of model producers in the UK that would produce models like this, custom, beautiful travel agent models for industry. And at his hotel, uh, where he had his shop, the Sheraton Skyline Hotel, they had a steady stream of I'm going to say Russian oligarchs and Arab oil sheikhs uh, for, uh, whose money was uh, basically unlimited. And they would basically see the models in his showroom, drool over them, and probably take them back by the plane load full uh, for display at their palaces uh, back in Saudi Arabia and in Russia. But for people like me, I could never afford these models because back in the 80s and 90s, I was a student and models like this back then cost 300 pounds or no, a 172nd cellulose, cellulose painted model like this from executive display models, I believe is 399 pounds. So it's a huge amount of money, uh, you know, back in the late 80s and early 90s. This model was probably made for uh, British air ferries, and I can't remember where I got it from, but they do not show up very often. It's very hard to find executive display models made by executive display models of the Vickers Viscount and the Vanguard for that matter. They are almost never appearing on the market. And when they do, the price point is probably in the three to four hundred dollar range if you can find them. But again, you, you just can't find them because they're so rare. And I love the Viscount. Growing up in Canada, I flew on Viscounts, on Air Canada Viscounts, and that's how I became so interested in the hobby. And the big brother to the Viscount was a Vanguard, and I'm also nuts about the Vanguard as well. This model is 172nd scale, so we'll get the trusty ruler and I can give you the exact dimensions of the model. That is exactly 12 inches. So there's another two inches on top of that. So that's about 15 inches nose to tail. And you're probably looking at about 18, 19 inches on the wingspan there. And under the side of the wings, we've got the Reggie. That's yeah, a super solid model. Uh, resin. The lines are exactly where they should be. You've got perfect dihedral there on the main wings and on your stabs. There's absolutely no brakes on this model. Luckily, it's not turning yellow, so I'm very grateful for that. So this is a model that I really love. It's a prize collection piece for me. I will probably keep it for a very, very long time. And yeah, I really do like the model. There's a few nicks and scrapes on the model, not too, too many. 
And if you're interested in learning more, you know I get to this point always, uh, Brian Austria Tompkins is well covered in my book, The Aircraft Display Model, Collector, Investor, and Appraisal Guide, which is 160 pages of all color information on the manufacturers of these models and the values of these models. But again, Brian Austria Tompkins was legendary in the, in the hobby and you can read all about him. There's a lot of information on executive display models in my book. You can purchase my book at my website, henrytenby.com. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have any Viscount models, uh, or if you have any models made by executive display models, please do let me know. Please share your models with us. You can leave comments, pictures, videos in the comment section of this video, and I'd love to see what you've got. And if you have questions, include them as well. So look forward to seeing you at the next uh, installment of our video series, Model Moment. If you enjoy the video, please do not hesitate to give me a thumbs up. That would be incredibly awesome. And I'll look forward to seeing you all in the next edition of Model Moment.